A word for our listeners. Season 2 of Masks of Nyarlathotep is set in the 1930s and 40s. We will be using terms and sayings from those times, including some that could be considered offensive. It's not our intention to offend. We merely wish to offer as accurate a view of the time period as possible. Welcome to Masks of Nyarlathotep, a Nerds Domain gaming podcast. Join us each week as our commandos uncover the corruption of the mythos in World War II. Starring Johnny Brown, Ed Maudlin, Chris Dunn, and Matt Quiet, with John Quiet running the table as keeper. Eldritch evils and crazed Nazi cultists await you just beyond this music. Hey everybody and welcome back to the Nerds Domain Presents Masks of Nyarlathotep. I'm Matt and I'm here with John. Hello. And Ed. I'm just saying if she's your fourth cousin, I don't think it counts. <laughs> wow, two out of three tonight <laughs> have been terrible. <laughs> two out of three. I mean, the, the other one was kind of just enlightening. Factually, and yes, yeah. sure. Yeah. Uh, and uh, uh, This Colin. one, terrible. I, I can't top kissing cousins. I can't do it. <laughs> I won't do it. No. I, I mean, uh, uh, we, we we were talking about Rudy, Rudy Giuliani. I don't think we were talking about anybody at the table. Nope. Unless they were just using Giuliani as a as a scapegoat to, <laughs> to as a, well, as, as, as shoehorn to to open the conversation. <laughs> yes, because that's often how I often yeah. open conversations. Yeah. <laughs> you know, Rudy Giuliani married his cousin. Yeah. yeah. Uh, so, John, we are maybe back in nineteen forty. You're, you're back in a cave. That's for sure. With a dead it, body, it are there? Like, are we back uh, in the cave? I mean, it sure looks are the like commuti- the cave. Is the computing equipment at the other or end? It, yeah, or is it like a parallel universe that has a cave just like this, but we get outside and like everybody like <laughs> dinosaurs? <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> wow, um, that's the question, isn't it? Wait, you got to go up the elevator so to the find elevator. out. Adolf oh. Hitler's a poodle. Come on. <laughs> Elevator doors are going to open. There's the broken Statue of Liberty. <laughs> <laughs> and then we just dropped our knees and screamed, Khan. Is that it's how weird. we're doing this? But the Statue of Liberty is Soil actually... Soylent Green is made of people. This, the Statue of Liberty is actually uh, Hitler. Like, what? <laughs> Come on. <laughs> wow, cross-dressing Hitler. That... No. Okay, we're yeah. going to move on. <laughs> um, so I'm going to yeah. go over to the elevator. Yeah. That is not down. That what? Is not down. It's up, right? Yeah, it's up. Because they were up, and now everybody is down. I'm there going. is a ladder that you could climb up. On it's the inside? On the inside of the shaft, yeah. Is there a button? Or Yeah, there's a button, too. Can, can we push, push the button? button? Uh, sure. Let's push the I mean, l- Listen. We, hey, here's the thing. <laughs> ah, crap. No, if you're if it's a different time, you're the one we left. There might be Nazis upstairs. Push the button. <laughs> All right. The elevator comes down. Uh, we will position ourselves to open fire on the elevator. <laughs> Is the inside three. of the elevator covered in blood? It takes a few moments, but the elevator comes down covered in blood. All right. We're fine. Okay. I, All right. Wait. All right. Wait. <laughs> back up. You both were excited about the, the elevator being covered in blood. I think we just need to note that this has happened. For completely different reasons than one would normally expect it's a person to be excited about an elevator covered in blood. It's Nazi blood. It's Mostly. Not, it's not Some someone discovering themselves. It's <laughs> it fine. Is, it is some leverage blood. Yeah, there's a little bit of leverage blood in that. Oh, yeah. um, there's just th- that just means there's a little bit of you in everything that you do. So I'm, we're gonna g- we're gonna get on the elevator. We're gonna yeah. get on the elevator and go on up. Yeah. Where are we going up? I say we go all the way up. All the way up. All right. Yeah. Mine as well. I mean, if the doors are gonna open to a murder fest, they're gonna mur- open to a murder fest. No matter which level. We're- Is there still energy coming off that thing? Can we tell? Uh, all the equipment was de- was disconnected from it and not. And we have no we have, idea. You how. don't. Okay. Yeah. I mean, you could try. Can we tell? Can we feel that static? No, you do not feel that static anymore. Okay. So if nothing else, it's powered down some. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I th- uh, we felt the static before we went back in time, correct? Yeah, you feel the okay. you felt the static as you 
you entered, like it, and it, it like hit you, and then it was sort of in the background of your perf, you know, perception throughout the entire time. Right. Yep. Yep. You were in the in the Got compound. It. Okay. Yeah. So got sure. bubble. We go up the elevator yeah. all the way to the top floor. All the way to the top floor. Um, there's uh, yeah, you're back in the the manor house. Um, on the first floor of the of the house, uh, you can smell something being cooked in the kitchen, but it is dead silent. Where was our stuff taken? Do we know where our stuff was taken? No. Okay. Okay. Where did they go? Where did who go? I'm sorry. Where did uh, Llewellyn and Mackenzie go to be questioned? Um, yeah, they, there's a, the building, they point to it. I forget where I said they were, but yes. So likely in that building? Yeah. Or the armory, which is nearby. Okay. There's a, there's an obviously Are, are armory. there men outside? There are not. The place is dead quiet. Not even like the towers or, I deserted. assume there were towers or I, something. There were towers there, but it is deserted. I would say that everyone that was here went back with us. They're all dead in the past. Hopefully. Well, oh crap! You're right. You're, well, I say they're all dead in the past, <laughs> as far as we know. Works for me. Yeah. Um, all in favor? <laughs> I. <laughs> for um, our purposes, as far as we know, they're dead in the past. I think we need to get our stuff and get out. I think you're right. Uh, armory or the offices? I guess that's sure, the other yeah. building. Sure. What, what do you think, <laughs> yeah, Jack? <clears throat> let's uh, l- l- let's go to where I uh, I was interrogated. All right, okay. uh, you say to get out, and uh, that's a, v- a viable option, and I know we don't have a whole lot of time here. However, it uh, might be a great idea to prevent, if it's possible, uh, to stop these Nazis from tinkering with this obelisk again. Right, or so after, back we, in the same go, situation that after we go check the, el- the, the office, sure, we're going to go to the armory and get whatever explosives we can, push the elevator button so it goes down, and set a timer so it blows up when it gets to the bottom. Okay, and here's another thing. Um, what if doing that somehow f's with the obelisk and it makes things worse? That's a risk I'm willing to take. If blowing things up hasn't solved problems yet, or blowing things what? up has probably solved every problem so far. Yeah. It really has. What, what, we, I, I say let's let's we set it to blow, and we leave the area and pretend we never saw any of this. Except we need to report stuff. I mean, we got to. Fine. We not only have to destroy. Well, I guess we don't. Once should we destroy the tower as well that was broadcasting the nope, signal? No, because once we bring down what's there, they're going to have to dig all that out. Mm-hmm. It's, it, I mean, we collapse that cave, it will be. Un, they will be unable to access that. Once that's down, that's all that matters. We know what they were broadcasting about, which was our mission parameter. I just don't correct? want them to dig another. Uh, elevator and then reactivate this thing and tinker with it later. Do you want to take it with us? Well, no, I don't want to take it with us. Okay, then what's our other option? (sighs) That's what I'm trying to figure out. (laughs) Blowing it up seems like a pretty good option. I'm I'm in favor of blowing it up. There's two of us. There's one of you, so we're going to blow it up. Wow. Democratic. We're we're, we're also the military and he's Go ahead and ignore the guy that uh, knows how to murder demons. Uh, tell Tell you what. Tell you what. We're going to go to the office. We're going to go to the armory. By the time we leave the armory, give another idea. I'm happy to hear it. No, we'll, we'll, we're on our way. I'm, I'm thinking. <laughs> this, is, this is our main yeah. plan, but yeah. let's go. I'm, I'm just saying these are the things we, we need to think about. I'm just saying, all. who's seen more stuff? You? Well, he's, he's now seen some stuff. He's seen some stuff, but we've seen that stuff many, and some other in stuff. In all fairness, he saw stuff first, technically, since it was farther in the past. <laughs> He saw stuff before okay. we saw the other stuff sure. we saw. All right. Okay. Okay. Unless time is relative to no, the, no, the right. observer. I mean, we're getting philosophical. Let's go to the office and get this stuff. Yeah. So you go back and get your uh, original weapons, your satchel charges. Are, which, are, uh, they're just one satchel charge. Llewellyn had a satchel charge. so I These are in the office? Yes. I mean, somewhere in the yeah, office. Okay. Right. Yeah. Okay, great. You find all your normal equipment, and then you're in the armory, and they have a pile of dynamite, a crate 
of dynamite. Um, <laughs> just a pile. A pile. Just, just sitting over just in the loosely corner. Loosely sitting. Yeah. yeah. Is, is, Where do you guys keep the dynamite? Yeah, somewhere over there. Is, is Acme stamped across the yes. top of it? <laughs> um, I'm going to change in back. Whatever in the German version of Acme is, yes. Das Acme? Yeah. <laughs> I'm, I'm pretty sure it's Latin, so it would just be Acme. Okay. Um, I'm uh, going to change back into our military uniforms. Okay. Yeah. Because, you know. <laughs> sure. Not being shot as a spy and all. Um, so can we put together like a really long um, fuse for this? Yeah, there's there's all the makings of a bomb. Like you, <laughs> all the I makings of a bomb. But I is there a southern there? But I did. Mm. But is there um, anything that we could like? Uh, can we set a timer, or does it have to be like a lit match or whatever? Oh no, there's there's definitely timer. Okay, well yeah. Let's Are do you gonna that. make us roll demolitions? No. Okay, thank God. <laughs> yeah, we've got time. We can, <laughs> you know. No, 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 no. So what I would like to do is go down, set it for. I'm a thirty-five. Five minutes. Yeah, it won't take that long. To or get no, no, no. Five area. minutes plus the time to get up out of the the the, bo- the bottom. Sure. Okay. So that we can go f- like come back up, and, and then run. get to a vicle and dry. I assume there's a vehicle here. Yeah, there's 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 trucks and stuff. You, and you've get seen a vehicle. Them. Yeah. Get our guys and get the hell out of here. Yeah. Yeah. Does that, does that all work? Yeah. So 15 um, minutes. Yeah. I mean, the the thing yes. is, you guys came in over rough country, not road. And oh, I just want to get back to the wa- about the part where it's going to turn onto that other road, get out of the G- the vehicle, and book it across land. Yeah, as fast as we, yeah. And it's destroyed. I'm not driving f- okay. towards the the barricade right, right, that right. we know is there. Yeah. Or there, was there, or might oh, be there um, one day in the future. I'm not really sure. The <laughs> What Past, about? future, perfect, subjunctive. We also we've got that demon body uh, there. We should do something with that. Yeah. It, yes. Yeah, so I'm gonna bury it in the rubble of the cave from the explosion. Yeah. Well, I didn't know if. Oh, you want to take it back and have it not studied? Like I can see where you're going there. Oh, put our top people on it. Top well, men. Top, top men. men. We could top we men. could do that. I was thinking more of kind of a uh, like a scare Nazi. You know, we just have it sit out. A you know, <laughs> hang a sign that says <laughs> "Beware," or you know, just any. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know if that's a good idea. Yeah, yeah. I don't know if it if that's a good idea or if it just give them ideas. I got to back up. A what? A scare Nazi? That's yeah. what we're calling it. That's what we're calling it. A scare Nazi. Yeah. yeah. Scare and crow, and scares crows. Scares crows. No, no. An I understand the, Nazi. I understand the etymology that you're using. Yeah. The words together in such a fashion, I find very funny. <laughs> <laughs> well, if you can think of a better term in the time it takes for us to set it up. Um, <laughs> I <laughs> think that maybe we should take it back with us. Okay. This is Okay, you're carrying it. <laughs> it takes okay. more than one man. I will also carry I, I it. Will, with you. I will wipe at the blood on my face <laughs> and say, all right. <laughs> Listen, if you want to bring back the crispy critter, I don't care. That's fine. That's How heavy it. is this thing? It's a human, but it's human-ish sized, maybe a bulky human. Um, so, but we're gonna. Oh but God, he stabbed it a whole bunch of times, so there, so it's, it's left most right, of its minus, blood behind. Minus the blood, yeah, it's desiccated. <laughs> sure. Yeah, well, uh, yeah, we'll drag it, take it in the truck, and we'll have to walk yeah. back. But whatever, we'll be okay. No, what do you mean? We have meant for Re- that. No, remember, we're gonna drop the. You know what I mean. We're gonna we're gonna ditch the vehicle though. It's true. We're going overland. Are you sure you really want us to be Get slowed down with a? Dead corpse. Nazi zombie corpse. Yes. Okay. I can't. Can I that's unassailable a, logic. Can I make a makeshift litter? Yeah. Okay. We'll so while they're setting up the bomb, and yeah, we, and uh, yeah, wing wing commander Llewellyn, Llewellyn, Llewellyn who has who's been t- no demolition. He has fifty five. Oh, he's thank very God. Quiet about yeah, all he's this. the demolitions guy. That okay. He's, he's He's leading by by example. He's letting right. us do it, and then when he when we do something he doesn't agree with, he'll speak up. Right, mm-hmm. right. I like that. I like Proving that. we've been right the whole time. Yes. <laughs> so 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 Llewellyn is actually plugging tab A into slot B, yeah. so that yeah. when we turn on the timer, it doesn't just go kablooey yep. right off the bat. Cool. Yeah. All right. So they set that up. I make a makeshift litter. We get the hell out. Okay. Are you good with all that? Um, yeah. Okay. Okay. Give me um, no rolls. You guys. <laughs> we pick up our two guys. You pick up your two guys. Who Even if it's just a book it to right before the T. Yeah. And get out and run. Over that would be that would be the thing is is. You guys have 
plenty of time to do that because they're not going to rush in right. to check out just because, because yeah. I mean, they they have to test every once in a while. To see yeah, they may not even know that it's down yet. Down yet. Yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah. So um, I want to test something, but I wish Rob was here to roll his demolitions. How about I roll his demolition? All right, rolls roll demolitions. He's got a fifty-five. He's got a fifty-five for yeah, demolitions. Yeah, and it's not that you're going to fail. It's just if you fail, it will take longer to set up. Fifty-five. Sounds like a success Fair to me. It sounds like you guys are you guys hit the T, and you see as you look out the rearview mirror, you you turn right because left is the the other mm-hmm. blockade. Yeah. And as you turn right to get away, you see the first trucks pulling around the curve. Okay. They're coming at you, and they see your truck driving away. But as they are hitting the T, that's where... Boom. Yeah. yeah. And the fireball that is the, um, the, the compound goes up, and it causes them to stop, which gives you the edge to drive around the next bend at which point you hop out and take it, take it, uh, you know. Yeah, if we can quickly, like, tie the wheel so it keeps going down the road and put a brick on it or something, like. Sure. So it keeps going. Go. So yeah. it looks so like go, it's still going. You go and wreck a truck. Yeah, and, sure. Because the road is not straight, so yeah. it just drives off a ways and crashes and causes more confusion mm-hmm. as to where, where who is driving this truck and, and yeah. everything. And then you Boom. take yeah, off yeah. across across land. I guess everybody give me a field craft slash sneak. Okay. Uh, check. I made that. I made Seven. that. Seven. <laughs> Seven. I did not make it. I impale. Well, two <laughs> out of three. It ain't bad. Ain't bad. And Baby, we can talk on. I so killed a lot of stuff earlier today. <laughs> I'm helping. <laughs> You're a little spent, huh? <laughs> it's, it's right. That's it takes fair. a lot of energy That's to murder those many demons. Whatever. That's fair. That's fair. So, um, it takes you days to get back to yep. where you were because you're also dragging a corpse to where we you. were as in like the town the yeah okay uh i'm assuming you want to go back to base camp to collect the other guys yeah sure yeah well, we'll go back to base so camp. You, you go to the lookout point where you had your men waiting for you yeah mm-hmm. where they could see they saw the explosion and they're there wait you know they're like what happened like what's going on what the hell is that they look at the litter. <laughs> it's been it's that been was, that was a Kramer esque <laughs> reaction. <laughs> it's been a couple of days. Hey Jerry, what the hell is that? Yeah. Uh, we'll discuss it back at base. Let's get in the truck and you let's know, there is no get in truck. There oh, is get get in line. Yeah, get it, there is March. Yeah. <laughs> let's just keep going. Yeah. Somebody needs to pick up the other end of this litter. <laughs> It'll go and faster that way. Yeah, so one of them does, and uh, guys hoof it. Uh, yeah, so you guys get back to camp, uh, tired, exhausted, mm-hmm. you know. Mm-hmm. And I mean, uh, we traveled a lot, all did. the way to Scotland. Yeah. <laughs> and um, 30 years in the past. Yeah, it took you 30 <laughs> years to get there and back, huh? Only yeah. 23. Oh, God, you're right. I'm sorry. I was exaggerating. Uh yeah, so hundred pound grouper <laughs> <laughs> taking so. the internet by storm. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, it's gonna make no sense in three months. <laughs> it isn't. It's gonna make zero sense. No. It's fine. Um, or three weeks, whatever. Anyway, uh, <laughs> three days really. Uh, Come on. So yeah, you guys are back at camp. Uh, mm. Obviously the. Uh, the guy I left in charge, I, I apologize, I left my notes at home. Lieutenant um, Berkshire. Berkshire was left in town, or left back. Got it written down. Yeah. In town. Um, he wants to meet with Llewellyn immediately to get the report. Uh, but you guys are, you know, basically asked to do your paperwork. <laughs> and, um, <laughs> All's fine. Yeah. Everything uh, was fine. Nazi encampment blown up. The end. <laughs> Everything's good here. So, how, how are you? <laughs> you guys put the uh, uh, black and the the demon thing in the fridge with the Wendigo thing. 
Oh, we still oh right, we got a Wendigo. Still have a Wendigo, right. a wendigo. Oh. and a giant Wait, when, wolf. When's the Wendigo expire? I mean, it's, it's in a freezer. Don't worry about it. Yeah, but I mean, like, it's gonna get freezer he's burn. He's gonna get freezer burn. I mean, don't is he gonna windig- reheat well? Don't Wendigos thrive in cold? Not, Not if, if they're dead. dead. I don't know what the laws of Wendigo are. I could come back to life. <laughs> uh, we can go talk to Frau Coppin. She can tell you. Yeah. Yeah. We right. could go talk to Frau Coppin. Um, so now that we're back, speaking you are. of Frau Coppin, <laughs> yeah. um, I'm going to take Jack Okay. and Fisk and the commander when he has time. And I'd like to go talk to Frau Coppin because this needs to be a conversation had not just with me, but everybody needs to be informed on what the hell's going on. Okay. About what I'm, what's going on with me. So. All right. Whenever that so happens, probably the next sure, couple of probably days. Then, this, yeah. this is a very special time for you. <laughs> your, your body's mm. going through a lot of changes. Oh, good God. <laughs> um, and I, ju- I just want you to know it's normal. <laughs> no. <laughs> no, no, it's not normal. So we'll go out to Frau Coppins. Okay. I'll, I'll knock. Okay. We won't she... surreptitiously go around the building with guns yeah. this time. Yeah, let's not do that. <laughs> um. So yeah, so she opens the door. And says, what are you doing here again? We had um, discussed me talking with you about my issues. I was hoping that you had time for that, and I was hoping that the commander, the captain, and Mister Fisk could hear exactly what's going on. Very well. Come in. Okay. I'll put on some tea. I'm sure we brought like biscuits or like something to to. Be you, nice. you bring you bring extra food and stuff. Yeah, nothing nothing big, just like snacks and such. Okay, you know, <laughs> we're good British folk. <laughs> All right, well, um, <laughs> yeah. So she lets you co- or comes in, puts a kettle on the on the fire, takes the best chair, and uh, says, "So what's going on?" <laughs> so we were cur- recently. Elsewhere, as you understand, this is a military exercise, so I can't divulge some things. But while there, we ran into some hostels. And while running into those hostels, I became very hungry and lost control of myself and ripped the throat out of several men, Mr. Fisk. Is that is that a fair assessment? Uh, I lost count, but yes. <laughs> um, and more, s- more than one, fewer than... Ten. Fewer he, than ten, I think. He killed people with his teeth. That's One, what he did. Once the hunger was somewhat sated, um, I found myself back in control of my facilities. However, I also found myself less hurt. My wounds had closed some. Take your shirt off? Yeah, sure. Okay. And, <laughs> and the bandages, I assume I'm bandaged on the... Because I'm still hurt. Yeah. Um, um, yeah, no, she, so she just asked you to take your shirt off. Oh, yeah. And then, um, Things get real. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so, um. Real world Belgium. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, go ahead. So, yeah, so Corey is, uh, kind of just a crisscross of scars, right? From, yeah. Yeah, he's got a lot of uh, wounds. Um, I guess I should technically have given you time to. Well, we'll do that. We'll handle that after this. Sure. Uh, time to heal mm-hmm. from resting. Cause you're, oh, you're I didn't rested. get a full week. If I have to well, have a, get a full week without strenuous activity, yeah. like running across the country. Sure. So after this, <laughs> we'll, yeah, 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 yeah. we'll handle that because yeah. that makes sense. Um, so she says, uh, okay, which, what, like, or any of these? <laughs> what wounds She's are like, we? Uh, there are a lot. <laughs> yeah. Um, I'd be like, well, this is where I got shot recently and that one's probably close because I did close yeah. one of them was gone and then I'll move the bandages I'll be like this one was also a sh- same time well, I mean like a few seconds apart and then this one and like this one's closed the first one's closed the second one's kind of closed and the third one's all but closed yeah i would be like this all happened in the same elevator <laughs> I would stop riding that elevator if I were <laughs> I mean, we did ride that elevator a lot more yeah, it's true. <laughs> right yeah, after yeah. that. We yeah. rode it all the way to hell. Yep. And back. <laughs> yep. Man, I don't think the people of Scotland are going to appreciate that. We yeah, just, really. <laughs> we just <laughs> lost all of our Scotland health. Scottish listeners. You know what I mean. Um, and you, you say it was 
when you drank the blood that this yes. happened. Um, further, I have been hearing, I've been I've been experiencing dreams similar to when the Wendigo was around. The Wendigo was a yellow-eyed, shaggy creature. This has been going on since before that, and it was red-eyed and seemed to want to take me, and I've been seeing the same um, setting over and over again. What setting? Um, a laboratory in... I'm sorry, I'm British. A laboratory <laughs> in, in a German castle where we encountered a creature and we have since brought that creature. We had captured that creature. It's still alive? I don't know what happened to it. I handed it off to my superiors. That was stupid. Why was it stupid? <laughs> describe the creature. I will describe it to her to the best of my recollection. So des desiccated corpse. Yeah. Red glowing eyes yeah. up until you blew its head off. Yeah. And got the black blood of the monster in your I don't mouth. remember that part. I don't know anything you, about that. Nope. You, nope. you don't talk about that? Nope. You don't talk about shooting it in the head until... Oh, no. I'll shoot. I shot in the head. I just don't remember getting the blood. If it got on me, yes. But if it got in me, no. I don't remember yeah, that Yeah, it did. You, you failed your roll then to yeah. check for that, so... Okay. I don't remember that. Yeah. I'm not going to remember that. I don't want to remember that. Then give me a sanity roll sure. to see if you don't remember that. Yeah. No, I'm fine with that. Oh, that's a two. <laughs> Okay, so you don't remember ingesting the blood of the creature. I forget, Jack. Do you remember him saying that? I don't remember ever telling you that. I don't remember that. Okay. But we're, you, I mean, we're, we're, we're talking about... You might want to edit this part out. I mean, that was like six weeks ago. Six weeks? Six months? When We when record once a month, and that was back when... Yeah. Yeah. It's before I was yeah. here. Yeah. That yeah. was, yeah. So that was this right is after a few Johnny. Ago, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. 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 So I don't even remember. You don't remember no. if that happened. Well, um, but you do remember I him. Crappy notes. Sure. <laughs> but you do remember him point blank blowing the monster's head off with a machine gun, with his Tommy gun. Oh, yeah. Emptying yeah. the drum into its, uh, yeah. I mean, into did, its skull. Was your mouth open? Nope. He was screaming. He's okay. going, ah. Yeah, so I'm pretty, probably got a little bit in you. Um, she, yeah, in so mouth. she so she says, you did you drink its blood? No, not that I remember. I mean, when we say drink, Frau. In jest. I mean, like, I mean, do we mean like gulp, gulp, gulp? Even, or? even a drop. Yeah, you probably drank it. What do you mean, Jack? Oh, you were. Your mouth was open. You turned his head into a fine mist. He got it on him. Some some of it probably got on your face. Get it all over my face. I don't remember. Uh, if you got a little bit of it in your mouth. You I are. trust Jack's eye. He's got two. You have one. Yeah, I've got, I got uh. two. You're the one with the only one eye. <laughs> um. That's my internal feelings. My yes. character is just yeah. stoic. <laughs> stoic, very stoic, yeah. Um, you, uh, the creature you encountered is a vampire. She says it with the French-German... Vampire. Vamp vampire, yeah. Um, normally... It, it even vampire. Vampire, yeah. Vampire. Normally, if the creature... Uh, had been at full power and willingly given you the blood, you would not still be here. You would be under its sway. But it seems that in the situation that you find yourself, it has not been able to establish full control. I suppose in that manner, you are lucky. Okay. But if you continue to drink the blood of mortal men as you have, your soul will be lost and you will become like the vampire. Is there a way to break this connection? I don't know. 
Do you know who might know? I don't. So there okay. are an esoteric order of creepy old ladies in the woods that you're a part of that maybe... <laughs> maybe she knows someone that knows more than her. I don't know. I don't know where she's been. It's the first time I've ever met this lady. <laughs> what would what would make that that connection stronger? Proximity, further ingesting of the creature's blood, further ingestion of mortal blood. You say you lost control. You describe like you were on death's door. Yeah, I was, were. I was when I lost control. I was full of holes and w- was going to die. So it's the the creature's will overtook you. You did not choose to drink the blood? I didn't. But although once it happened, you, it did taste good. Out of character, you <laughs> may have. I don't remember the exact situation in the recording. I, may I don't think I option. remember. I don't know. I failed a sanity check. That's okay, what happened. So that's, that yeah, was, yeah, yeah. Okay, great. So, yeah. So um, avoid that situation again. <laughs> 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 if you're going to get near death, you should just die. <laughs> okay. Wow. I mean, unless you want to become like that thing. You've that that same manner could use a little work there, Doctor. <laughs> Where did she you gives a shrug. Eh, I don't care. Where did you learn this lore? My mother and my mother's mother. It is passed down. So no books. Not not here. Okay. Where? I wouldn't know. I mean, learned men live in cities and keep their books in libraries. We trust legend and, and, you know, parents, mothers to pass down knowledge to daughters and fathers to pass down knowledge to sons. That is our way. Do you feel that if I were to reveal this to the church that they would kill me or help me? I've forgotten the priest's name. Oh, I don't. Do you, I gave him a name. Yeah. Uh, if he believes you, and after the Wendigo incident, he might. It's hard to say. He would his. He would try. He would either try to kill you or use his orders methods to try and expel the inf- the infection. I'm not sure it would work. End of the larger church. Again, if you found a true believer in this, I don't know. I don't know what the, I don't know what the um, people would do. But many around here will see you as a monster. You probably aren't safe if you go telling other people this story. I brought the two men I trust and Mr. Fisk, because Mr. Fisk experienced what I was going through. Correct. I don't plan Experi- on... You mean witnessed? Yes. yes. Sorry. That's fine. I That's saw his eyes turn red, and then he killed a bunch of people and drank their blood. I don't but believe anything that intense. It's just a witnessing. It's more of a... Sure. Experience I, you I, go through. But I, yeah. yes. she was asking to clarify yeah. between... I was a little, yeah. a little more than a spectator, sure. Um, I don't plan on telling you outside of the five of us. I won't divulge your secret either, unless you become a threat. I would hope that by that time, Jack or the commander will put some bullet in me. How can they kill me if that happens? At this stage, you are still you still seem mortal. If you weren't, you could not abide the sun. So the sun hasn't even like not even not even like an itch. No. Okay. Is there anything that we can do if he does happen to turn? Uh, into a vampire to prevent him from attacking us? Holy symbols or I don't know what else. Can I roll knowledge on that or lore? Or well, also I'm asking occult. her. Occult. Yeah. Um, sure. Do you want to roll a cult before she answers? Sure. I got a 13 over 5. <laughs> hey, you know what? He's just trying to mark off them boxes. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you said if you want to roll a cult. I did. I want I to. I did, yeah. Ed? I don't think any of us have a cult. Eight, eight over five. But I'm really close to him. Yeah. Um, no? Uh, the um, 
there are legends. I can't verify that they're true because I have never actually encountered a vampire on my, you know, in person. But there are legends that people of true faith can keep them at bay with their symbols they believe in, the power of God. But again, that requires you to be true and pure in your belief. Hmm. Do you have a daughter, Crow? I do not. Who will you pass this knowledge on to? <laughs> there are girls in the village that might be worthy of becoming an apprentice if they choose to ask, but that is um, a concern. What if they don't ask? Then they will not be taken on as apprentice. But what happens to the knowledge if they don't ask? It dies with me. Or hopefully their mothers were told and they can take up my position. Would you be willing to explain the things you know to other people that are not an apprentice? Are you offering yourself as an apprentice? Are you offering to learn the knowledge? No, I'm saying that there are men smarter than I, more learned than I within his majesty's service that would see the information you have as a wealth of protections or at least knowledge that we could operate from. We've operate, we've, uh, we've seen two fully supernatural things and something else. And that's just been here in Belgium. Right. I mean, I mean, we, we have an, a maritime attorney who is a wolf <laughs> fish man. <laughs> <laughs> we we've we've seen a, a vampire wendigo and um, other things mm -hmm. and rituals. I mean, ritual would be a fair assessment since we know that that was a thing. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. And rituals that uh, are far beyond my knowledge. I'm thinking that His Majesty's intelligence services would be would benefit from you and your knowledge. It has been my experience with men from His Majesty's armies that they do not respect the old ways. If I found one that I thought would, would you take my um, reference and meet with him? I would give him the shot. Okay. I'll and warn you that it's not an easy thing to learn so you better be prepared how to long learn would it take oh years I have an army to fight or I have a war to fight I have an army to fight <laughs> whoops uh, armies <laughs> I, I have, I have a war to fight or I would sincerely consider taking that position but I don't have the time and I uh, can't just leave the army I'm not sure I would trust it to and afflicted anyway. <laughs> That's fair. But, like I said, if you find the right person, it is possible. Well, I might know somebody, if he's alive. <laughs> we didn't... If we didn't kill their <sighs> grandfather. Right. <laughs> All right. Um, or father, whatever. At this, is there any way to? Are there any poultices or anything that I can take or use that would slow any of this? Help me resist it. Um, Do I need there, to eat a head of garlic every night or something? I don't have any thing like that. I have. I can give you a charm that might help. I can't make any promises, though. Any assistance, even attempted assistance, I would be very appreciative of. Okay. I will need a week. Sure. But I will deliver it to your camp, uh, to your base when it is complete. Okay. Okay. Anything else, guys? Any other questions for Frau <laughs> Coffin? Any, mm -hmm. any. You need to find out how long the steak needs to be just to, to jab into my heart. or <laughs> I'll make it up. <laughs> We'll just wing it. It's fine. Yeah, it'll be okay. Don't worry. You'll be dead. Good. 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 Thanks, guys. Thanks. No problem. 
All right. So I would thank her. Leave whatever we brought, you know, the biscuits or whatever it is. Mm-hmm. Just leave them with her. Cof- the coffee ring. Yeah. Coffee ring? Yeah. It's like, a, it's like a Danish. Oh, gotcha. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I've never heard it called a coffee ring. Sorry. I've called coffee cake. Coffee cake, sure. Yeah. But okay. I get where you would get coffee ring. That makes yeah, sense. Yeah, yeah sure, think, sure. Yeah. Um, I've never heard it called a coffee cake. No, it's, a, no, no yeah. it's okay. Yeah, it, it's fine. Coffee ring. Like, is that a ring you drop in water and it becomes coffee then? That's an even better idea. It's like a lifesaver, only coffee. Yeah. We call it a lifesaver. <laughs> <laughs> Marketing at its best, guys. <laughs> you clever devil. You clever vampire. So I will, uh, yeah, I'll head back to the. the yeah. Does anybody else, does anybody honestly have anything else? She's like an old lady, right? Yeah. Yeah, we're not gonna screw. Like, I'll get out of here. <laughs> <laughs> well, he's I mean, Italian. You, he's Italian. I mean, I mean you were asking uh, if she had a daughter. I mean, like I, that I, was I, not doesn't. where I was. At going. first, I was like, "Do you want one?" I mean, <laughs> that was not where I was going at okay, all. I, I mean. <laughs> I don't know how old a lady she is. I mean, are we talking like <laughs> Cloris Leachman in, you know, Young Frankenstein or Cloris Leachman today? I mean, you know. Closer to Cloris Leachman today. Okay, but, well, yeah, but again, this, this is the 40s, so, I mean, that could be like 20 years old. That's true. <laughs> That's, true. <laughs> That's true. That's true. So we head back on the way back to. Hard living. <laughs> <laughs> on the way back to our, our hotel. Yeah, he wow. took over the hotel. I think that uh, maybe it's time to contact um, the home office and ask them to send someone. To look at the... To look at the things we have, plus yeah. discuss with... If, if I feel comfortable, and I would like to have your input, send them out to Frau Coppin as well. Sure. Okay. Uh, yep. I don't think... I'm assuming that wherever this thing that is controlling or that it, that wants me is it's in England so I don't think I'll be going back to England anytime soon that's what they told you did they tell yeah. me that they have it or did they tell you us where they were taking it oh no no they didn't tell you anything but, about but England would clearly be the option yeah okay yeah. Hmm. so okay okay all right so um, you radio your request for a specialist yeah. in dealing with some weird stuff? Yep. Okay. okay. Then I think this is a good time to take a break in the story because yeah. you're going to hang out here for a yeah. few weeks Yeah. while they the, the wrangle group, someone and send them. Yeah, the other group is getting ready to jump to May after their next thing. And we are in... We're in March right now. Yeah, that's... So... So we that should down, get more than enough time for us to get information to them and the, for them to come back with somebody. I think that's where we'll we'll pick up the story is the arrival of the specialist. Specialist. Yeah. Okay. A um, couple of things. Do you want us to? Yes. Uh, up up skills and stuff. Yeah. You want to take your healing from the week. I have two wounds, so I will heal one and I heal three. That heals me. Cool. Uh, uh, sorry, how do I heal again? So, th- how many wounds do you have? Do you know? Uh, I was just wounded the one time. So, you'll yeah. roll a D3, mm-hmm. as long as we're not doing anything strenuous. So, okay. roll a D6. One and two is one. Two and three is four. Th- so, so, you got two back. Two. Okay, well, I'm back to full strength. Okay. Same thing for you, Mr. Fisk, unless you didn't get shot because you were too busy being a badass in an elevator. You know, my dexterity is only nine, but I didn't take a scratch, brother. <laughs> Um, and then we're going to go through anything that we have marked. Um, we're going to roll percentile. You want to roll over the number you have written on your sheet. Got it. If okay. you do successfully roll over, you will then roll a d10 and add that to the skill. Okay. Does that all make sense, nope. what I just said? Yes. Yes, yes okay. it makes sense. <laughs> nope. Okay. Okay. Ah. Oh, look, field craft didn't go up. <laughs> Imagine that. Okay, so... Oh, but my German did. If my you take it above 90? If you take it above my 90, you get... Sanity back. Something back. I, some okay. amount of sanity, I have to go look. And then we just roll the D10, D10 and, and then whatever that is, we add, add to that it. to the number. Awesome. Uh, is there any possibility of us upping any other skills? I've been you allowing people to kind of like train things up a little bit at a time. 
if anybody didn't heal after the first week, then yes. Not if, heal. Train. Um, Sorry. No, no, no. Okay, so you all healed on the first roll. You both, right. yeah, both yeah. Uh, Matt and Ed healed your characters after the first week of rest. Right. So, yes, everyone is eligible to train. Um, we're going from sometime in March to sometime in May. Yeah. So, March, April, May. Four. Do you, know, do you happen to know dates specifically? Um, probably May 10th or shortly before. May 10th is when the official, like... Plot. In invasion begins. And the, okay. the, and the area we're in, we're dead if it's yeah. after May 10th. Okay. Um, so probably, I would say probably end of April for what, what you were looking to do. Okay. I've got still a good time frame. Radio operator marked twice? Does that matter? No, nope, just it doesn't matter. Yeah, it doesn't okay, matter. that's what I thought. So. Cool beans. It may have been a leftover from character creation that you had an extra mark. Right. Yeah. Or you just might have gotten excited and marked it a second. <laughs> Maybe I did. Maybe that marked it before he understood the... Oh, one. That's real. Yeah, it bad. happens. Damn it. <laughs> oh, well, at least that was a radio operator thing. My German went from a 30 to a 38. So Ooh. let's say... Spot hidden went from a 35 to a 37. All right. So you, I'm going to say four weeks you... Yeah, let's just go four weeks you... Four skills to attempt to up again. Okay. Does that make? Does that seem fair? Yes. Okay. Sure. And for the record, I went up. Can um, it be what we already marked? Oh or yeah. Just anything? This, yeah. After you, after you've gone through everything you marked, you can pick any four. Any four. Okay. Can, okay. This, can we pick the try. same one more than once? I'm done. So if I really no want to get better. Twice. Okay. So if I want to really get better at military doctor, and I get up that twice. Yes. And it's just a roll of d10, or do you want us to st still try and roll over it? I've been letting them roll a d10. Just okay. I, I, Fair I, enough. I increased my throw to 37, nice. my military doctrine to 64. Cool. And, uh, yeah, I still can't. Uh, and, oh, and, and, and I had a couple of things <laughs> that I had checked, like submachine guns now a yeah. whopping 26. Yeah. Well, I. You might want to work on that. I just mm -hmm. cleared ma machine guns, so I'm going to be even better at it. Um, my close combat. Not by a lot, but I did it. My close combat went to a 92. <laughs> Is that uh, yeah. go over 90? So I'll get 2d6 of sanity, sanity back. back. Awesome. That's great for Seven you. Seven. not. That's I'm great. not complaining. That's, hey, you know what? Average ain't bad either. No. And then we just, you said pick four of whatever. And four then of whatever. Okay, great. Um, if you want to include sanity, I'll let you roll a d6 on sanity one time. Okay. If you want to heal sanity, so you took a week of meditation. Okay, I will do that. Three. I'll take okay. three. Four. Do you want it to increase your sanity more? You're happy? Do, do I have to give away... Uh, you have to give away one the nope. week, uh, one training. No, because I just went from 64 to 71. Oh, yeah, you're fine. Like I, and you're my max is 75, so like I just went way back up. Yeah, you did. Yeah, yeah. I'm at 66 now, and I, so that might yeah. completely... If up to this number you circled, if yeah, if that's you got a four on the die, right, and you have four, yeah, slashes, so right. yeah, you just erase it and recircle that same number. Awesome. And uh, does that uh, does that come at the sacrifice of? Uh, I have one of the four okay. skills. You you took a week of meditation to just get yourself centered and and. Is there something makes we're sense missing at the table? Okay. What do you mean? No, this is a question to you guys. You two. Is there something at the table oh. that we should have that we do not have? Like, Colt, clearly we're missing something. So I could probably say that I spent a little bit of time with Frau Kopp and at least understanding the basics. Maybe. No? You could. Um, uh, uh, Wing Commander Llewellyn has no occult. Yeah, I think either. we're missing out on occult. Yeah. I mean, um, if it's a thing you want to learn, yeah. Well. There's... There's always Cthulhu Mythos. <laughs> no. Actually, that's not one I allow them I to know, do because I that know. one's bad. It is. Well, hmm. maybe Dodge should go up, Matt. Wait a minute. Cthulhu Mythos is bad? The so for every point in Cthulhu Mythos you get, you know how you circled a number in your sanity? Uh -huh. And that's like your max sanity. Right. But you can go back up to that. Every point of Cthulhu Mythos you get, you start blacking out the boxes. So you get one point of Cthulhu Mythos, 
you no longer can have this 99 sanity. And the more Cthulhu Mythos you get, the more gets blacked out. And it's not like, oh, this is my max. If my power goes up, maybe it'll go up. You can never go above that number. That's so blacked out. So the more you know, the less you're ever possible able to sanity. be a sane. So even though my my max sanity when I started this game was 65, I could technically go up to 99. You could. If you could. if you found a way to raise your power uh, your power of will, mm -hmm. then yes. Okay, but once I start le learning Cthulhu Mythos, the maximum. The, uh, I, yeah. I learn one thing, and now and that, I'm down to 98. One, yeah. Okay, got it. Yeah. All right. Is um, as far as my uh, dodge, can I increase that, or is that you a hard on this? No, you can. No, you definitely can. Awesome. I'm definitely doing that. Yeah. Man. And I missed. No. Um, Boss. Uh, Matt allows the other group to just roll a d10 and add it, so you can just roll that d10. I should have done just that, that one. I didn't. Okay, so, so okay. Did you pick what skills did I, you I, increase? I, I already increased skills, so uh, I, I increased. You took your four. Yeah, you took, took a sanity. Four. I took my and four. And then what else did you? Uh, I took my sanity. I tried to increase my radio operator and failed. And well, again, uh, like, so you've, you've gone through all the ones you had checked off, right? Yes. So clear those boxes. Of I think just, I did. Just erase everything in those, yeah, of those yeah, boxes. Yeah, I did. And then you get to pick. Uh, four things. One of them you picked sanity. Just roll a d10 and mm -hmm. add that in. No, no check to see if you get to. Just do it. Oh, okay. I understand. Yeah. Okay. So, uh, so, so whatever you want to change, just add. A, okay. Just roll a d10 and add to it. Okay. Then M military right. doctrine. Okay. Martial arts and throw plus um, sanity. Plus sanity. Cool. Okay, yeah. do, you do you understand how martial arts works? Probably not. No, probably not. <laughs> okay, so here's how this is going to work. Uh -huh. If you use anything that can be used in martial arts, so in th that includes like knife, uh -huh. martial arts for that. Sure. Um, close fist, combat. Kick. Close combat. Close combat. Uh -huh. If you roll, you'll roll your percentage on whatever that is. So let's say it's close mm -hmm. combat, you roll your percentage like normal. You succeed on your close combat. If mm -hmm. you also get under your martial arts, you will double your damage. Got it. Okay. Cool. If you crit with some, or with, if you impale with something that can impale, you can like super impale. Got it's, it. It's murder. Okay. Cool. Okay. So what you're saying is, if like if I if I keep building on my martial arts score, I could wind up doing double damage anytime I do damage. Yes. I'm I gonna would, keep working on that then. I would never raise it higher than the thing that you're gonna be attacking people with. Like uh, like my fist, fifty three. Or co or com close combat, close combat is uh, fifty one. Yeah, so I wouldn't raise it above fifty right now uh -huh. until you see those start to go up. Well, yeah, but I mean it's not like right. I can do that in one fell swoop anyway. Right. Where are you at right at this point? Ooh, ooh, unless we can do like a matrix sort of thing where you like plug something in my head and I'm like, I know kung fu. <laughs> Uh, no. You know, had you messed with that dial a little more, we could have. We could have. We could have gone okay. to the Matrix future. Wow! But you didn't. That's so what, well. <laughs> So now Why did you guys have to blow up the obelisk? <laughs> well, we don't know that we blew the obelisk up. We know we collapsed the tunnel, tunnel. or the, the, the cave. cave. I raised, naturally raised my German, my spot hidden, and my close combat, because spot hidden was kind of rough. Um, and then I also rose my spot hidden again. With um, your training? Yeah. So I have a total of 44 in spot hidden. I nice. feel really good about that. I had a uh, 30, I had 35. Yeah. That's right, yeah. Um, Dodge it went up some to a 39. My military doctrine went up to a 25 and my command went up to a 17. It's clear that we're going to have people in the field with us. I didn't know that when I built the character. So now I'm going to be able to command. I think, you, I think you did know that. You just were like, yeah, I'll let somebody else do it. Right. I because assumed. That, yeah, yeah. We had different characters well, in the party at that and time. And now I also read what command does and really thought that through because I can use my command in, in place of anything they do as long as I give them that command. So oh, my command so is when I 80, have NPCs on the field, I should be giving you command rolls. Unless our command sucks. Right. If they have like if they have a good rifle sure. roll, then use yeah. their rifle. Yeah. But if my command is a is a fifty and I'm like, go climb that wall and their command and their climb's a ten, they climb that wall at my fifty. 50. Yeah. So But so then you would be rolling command instead of yes. them rolling their climb. Yeah. So I can tell yeah. people how to shoot better. I'll have to remember to how to how to incorporate that. Yeah. And then you, when you're not shoot Ed, when you're not shooting with a gun and you're mm -hmm. doing melee stuff, you need to remember your martial arts score. Sure. Yeah. Which what's okay. where's where's it at? Right Twenty one. Twenty one. Twenty one. So, so hey, that's that's hey, decent. So when, when we're nothing. when we're adding this 
heart. Do I just roll it once? Just and roll it once and add that number. Is that for each thing I'm trying to increase, or do I re-roll every time I'm trying to increase each thing? Roll for each of the things. Awesome. That's yeah. what I thought. So you And you used one of those on your sanity to get right. those four back. Yep. So you have so three, got three of these ones. left. Okay, yep. that's all I even know. Yeah. I'm good now. Yeah. 92 seems like a good number for me. <laughs> I got 92 in my field craft and 92 in close combat. Nice. nice. Yeah, I need to up my close combat. I mean, I'm a sniper. But yeah. Like clearly, we're we're doing less sniping, and yeah. I need to do more close combat. Close combat. The only problem with that is you're in melee, so you get one attack around. Period. That's it. Yeah. As opposed so. to being able to fire three yeah. times. Which yeah. Um, okay. I think that's actually going to do it. That's a good place. I know, Colin, you're finishing up, yep. right? I got one left to do. Okay. So we're good. Well, that's that's fine. Um, that's actually a great place to, I think, to stop it. I'm going to add yeah. a little bit of that out anyway. Sure. Um, yeah, so next time we will be jumping forward to just before the invasion, which is of, a very, um, of Belgium, uh, Netherlands, uh, Luxembourg, and France. Which is where you are at? Not yet. They will well, you're be. In, you're in this party is in Belgium, right? Right, yeah. yes. So that can be bad. So. Uh, we have other podcasts out there. They are at nerdsdom.com. You should check those out. And we will talk to you guys next week. Uh.